For cheap Minecraft hosting, be sure to go ahead and check out Clovex.net. What is going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to render audio in Tony Vegas Pro 11, 12, or 13. Now just before I get into this video, if you'd like to request a tutorial on Tony Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, Photoshop, After Effects or even Cinema 4D, then be sure to leave in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. Now since I'm recording this on Christmas Day, I just want to say Merry Christmas to all of you, hope you're having a good Christmas, and since the video is going to be out the day after Christmas, I hope you got everything you wanted. So we're getting straight into it, let's say you have an mp3 file like I have right here, and you dragged it in, you want to render it out, well it's very simple to do. You just highlight it like that, so double click it, get the region loops, come to file, render as, and now you can pick. You can see you can use it as a WAV, or you can use it as an MP3, completely up to you. I recommend any one of those two, and mainly I go for WAV simply because it has a smaller file size, and yeah, call it whatever you want to, so it was an instrumental, so I'm going to call it instrumental. Click render, and there you go, it's going to be rendering very fast. Now let's say you have audio, so you made your own beat or something in like FL Studio. However, you want to make it into a video and you want to be able to upload it to YouTube. Now this part, it's easy as well. All you got to do is right click here, click insert a new video track, and this is what should happen. Now from here you can drag an image on top here, or you can just come to media generators, add some text, and you can just drag it on here, and we'll call this instrumental. And then you can just say by CS even though I didn't make this instrumental. And then fill it all the way up so it takes up the entire video, like so. So it starts and finishes at the same time. Same thing again, double click up here, get the region loops. Come to File, Render As. And this time, you're not going to do it as a WAV or an MP4. You can use it as a WMV or any other file type you like. Personally, I recommend WMV, 720 or 1080. Completely up to you. I always do 720. And then this will be called instrumental. It can be called instrumental again because it's going to save as a .wmv, whereas the last one saved as a .wav. So render it, and you can see it's going to be a quick rendering because it's only text and music. So there you have it. That is how you render audio in Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12, or 13. Very simple. I'll show you how to render it as a video file as well as an audio file. Like I said at the start of the video, if you would like to request a tutorial on Tony Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, Photoshop, After Effects, or even Cinema 4D, then be sure to leave in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. With that being said, be sure to go follow me on Twitter, I'll keep you updated when I'm posting and what I'm posting. Also be sure to go and check out my technology news channel, I'll keep you updated on the best technology news. And finally be sure to go add me on Snapchat, I'll show you I do throughout my day. So yes, thank, you so much. thank you so much for watching, please subscribe, wait, and peace.